surprising Yeah, for sure. It's uh, an amazing player. I knew more or less what to expect. Um, I had some chances also in the first set. He handled it better than I did, and um, you know the set was away. So in the second set, I tried to stay a little bit more aggressive. I started off also feeling a little bit better. Then the rain came, and then after it. It changed a little bit. Um, I'm really happy how I handled the situation on the court, and yeah, just happy about about the win today. Um, yeah, and that's it. English, please introduce yourself. Thank you. Adam Ross, Florida Tennis. Yannick, congratulations on the victory today. Um, can you talk a little bit about what you think you did best, especially in the last two sets, and how you'll build on that moving forward through the tournament? Please, thank you. Yeah, I've, I think I played with a little bit more intensity, uh, general. Um, but you know, it's 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 also tough when uh, the opponent is serving this well. Um, it's it's tough to get into the rally. Um, he's he's an amazing player. You know, he has so many huge weapons with the serve and the forehand, and you know, even the net game is really really good. So, you know, I think you know he started off really well the match and. Um, I just try to stay focused about my service games, which then I made a couple of mistakes when when he broke me. But he played also a good game there in the first set, and and that's it. No, you sometimes you have to accept it um, somehow, which which I've done. I just try to stay mentally strong, and and that's it. And and the next match we see what's coming. Now it's for sure a tough match. I don't know yet against who who I'm gonna play, and then yeah, let's see. Any great nine radio Australia. Um, you'd never lost a set to him pre in the previous three matches. So, how much of a level of concern was there today w with the way this match went until you really asserted yourself in that final set? Every time when you lose one set, it's you have to be concerned. But also before the match, you you know more or less what to expect. He is a player who has huge weapons, as I said before. So you have to control what you have to control. But the other part, you you can't really control, right? If he serves really, really good, especially in important moments like he did today, it's it's tough. And um, I was, yeah. Uh, you know, when you are break down, um, set down, and then you are four all, five all, it's 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 fast that, uh, that the match is over, um, and that's why today was a good day for me because I was in a really tough situation and and I handled it somehow to to win, and that's why I'm why I'm happy. Anyone else? Yeah. Ira Kaufman, uh, Iron Sports. In the beginning of the match, the shadows of the court were a little unusual in terms of the, when they come down half court, half half bright, half dark. Did that bother you at all? Uh, I entered with full. was not me. was the match before. Uh, me was already uh, full in the shadow. <coughs> Two more, one here. As, as you, you were saying, you don't know who you've got next. Um, and they're on now, so it's still in early stages. Um, what do you know about Martin Dam? And if you were to play Chris, what are your thoughts on that one? Against Chris, I lost. Um, I lost two years ago or something like this in uh, in Atlanta, uh, where I won doubles with with Rayleigh Dan. Um, he is a really good player. Um, good good serve, um, moving really well. <laughs> tough tough player, and then the other one I I. I I don't know, so I, I have to learn. My, my coach is out to watch a little bit of that match, so he's gonna give me some feedback. But mostly, I think I have to stay on my on my things. What I have to do, I'm gonna study my opponent for sure. But you know, I try to stay on my uh, on my intensity, like I've done today in the in the second and third set. And and if it works good, if not, I have to find a a solution like today. So um, let's see for sure. Tough match, you know, uh, third round in a in a big event. It's it's nobody comes there for no reason, so it's I have to be really careful. Last one. Yannick, I'm going to take you off the tennis court for just a minute. I hope that's okay. Um, I know you were a champion skier. Um, I'm wondering if you still ski, if you think it helps your athleticism, if it helps your tennis, and if you ever wonder 
whether you could have been a, uh, a champion at skiing. Thank you. No, I don't think about <laughs> about this anymore. But um, sometimes, you know, it's good for my mental part to to don't stay on the tennis court doing some different things. Um, going to ski for me is always our our relief, and it you know. Um, images of, of back in the days come comes in my head and and you know going with the friends that's that's so nice no and usually we day uh, we make two days per year um on the slopes so even this year we went this uh, this couple of days and it was really nice for me it's just you know to recover also you know the mental the mental side and and that's it um but you have to be careful, you know. It's 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 going fast that you that you uh, fall and then then you know. Uh, hopefully, it's not going to happen, but you know, it, and that you break something and and then are big issues. So <laughs> I'm very calm on the on the skis now. I'm not like like the young kid I was before. <laughs> Thank you. Ira Kaufman, uh, Iron Sports. In beginning of the match, the shadows of the court were a little unusual in terms of the, when they come down half court, half half bright, half dark. Did that bother you at all? Uh, I entered with full. Was not me. Was the match before? Uh, me was already uh, full in the shadow. As, as you, you were saying, you don't know who you've got next, um, and they're on now, so still in early stages. Um, what do you know about Martin Dam? And if you were to play Chris, what are your thoughts on that one? Against Chris, I lost. Um, I lost two years ago or something like this in uh, in Atlanta, uh, where I won doubles with with Rayleigh Dan. Um, he is a really good player. Um, good good serve, um, moving really well. <laughs> tough tough player, and then the other one I I. I I don't know, so I, I have to learn. My my coach is out to watch a little bit of that match, so he's gonna give me some feedback. But mostly, I think I have to stay on my on my things. What I have to do, I'm gonna study my opponent for sure. But you know, I try to stay on my uh, on my intensity, like I've done today in the in the second and third set. And then, if it works good, if not, I have to find a a solution like today. So um, let's see for sure. Tough match, you know, uh, third round in a in a big event. It's it's nobody comes there for no reason, so it's I have to be really careful. <laughs>